It's been a successful start to the 2013-2014 season for the Notre Dame hockey team. And on Friday night, they look to continue their winning ways against Michigan Tech. Senior goaltender Steven Summerhays coming off two straight shutouts to start the season, and he picks up just where he left off last weekend. He makes a save during an early Husky power play and keeps the game knotted up at zero. We broke down defensively several times in the early parts of the game, and, and, uh, and he made some good saves then too, but I mean, you know, he played well when we needed to, especially as the game progressed. Just a few minutes later, Vinny Henestroza sends it to Steven Fogarty on the left wing, and Fogarty knocks it past the Michigan Tech goalie to give the Irish the early lead. That's Fogarty's first goal in this young season. Later in the first period, Notre Dame on the power play. Robbie Russo fakes the slap shot, and he fools the Huskies to give the Irish a two-goal lead at the first intermission. In the second period, Irish on the power play. Russo has it stolen, though, and C.J. Ike has the breakaway for Michigan Tech. He shoots and scores the shorthanded goal. That's the first goal that Notre Dame has given up this season. A little less than 10 minutes to go in the period, the Huskies on a five on three power play and Shane Hanna one times one pass Summer Hayes to tie the game at two. Two goals, I mean, it's the worst lead in hockey. You know, it's just enough to make you a little comfortable and make the opponent that much hungrier. So it was a little bit of both. Less than 10 minutes to go in the game, Mario Lucia drops the puck off for TJ Tynan and the senior puts the Irish back on top. That's Tynan's first goal of the season and Notre Dame holds on for the 3-2 win. Mario made a great play. Um, he gave me a lot of time in the slot, more time than I actually thought I had. Um, I kind of just tried to throw it on net, and then luckily it went in. Now the two teams will not play tomorrow night because of the Notre Dame versus USC football game, but they will finish the series Sunday afternoon at 2.05 p.m. here at Compton. For Fighting Irish Digital Media, I'm Megan Bastido. Go Irish!